Hello and welcome to TV. The place where you'll find youth videos anywhere from documentaries to short films to music videos. And a whole bunch more. The first video we have for you today is a silent film called Acceptance by Jess, Carly, and Mariah. It's very much a metaphor for just accepting people for who they really are. Okay, I'll be looking out for that. That was very inspiring. I agree. Well, the next video we have for you is a monologue, and it's by Ben about procrastination. So, Giovanni, what do you think about procrastination? I'll tell you later. Okay. You know what sucks? Procrastination. Putting things off. All it does is make you fall behind. Let me give you an example. My parents recently went to the States for a shopping trip, and they gave me a list of stuff I had to do. Basically, just make sure the house was clean before they got back. And like any other sane person, I hate, hate, hate cleaning. So, naturally, I put it off. And then, this morning, I woke up, 
and discovered they're coming back today. Oops. At least I know I'm not the only one. Oh, come on. You do it too. Ever had any homework you were supposed to do, but you just kept um, putting it off? You go to school and you make up some stupid excuse like, My dog ate my homework. I forgot it at Burger King. I was raking leaves outside and a lion jumped out from the bushes and I had to ward it off, but all I had was my pencil in my back pocket and it bit it right in two and I didn't have anything to write with. So then the teacher says, So you got another pencil, right? You would think, but I was locked out of my house by the lion. So I had to go to Swiss Chalet, sneak into the back room to pick up a steak, but unfortunately my homework was in my right pocket and I accidentally fell and it came out of my pocket and fell into the deep fryer and that's why I don't have any homework. But I got my pencil. Detention. Procrastination sucks. Well that video was really easy to relate to. And, oh, um, I have some homework that I forgot to do, so I, I gotta go do that. Don't run, the Crystal Clubs will get you! Well anyways, many genres are very popular around the world, whether they be romance or comedy or action, but cops have often topped them all. We actually have a cop video for you here today. It's by Jesse, Taylor, Mike, and Shannon. Enjoy this next video. The following program is filmed on location with the men and women of Crestwood Secondary School. All footage in this program is real and the depicted events are extremely dangerous. Every suspect is innocent until proven guilty. Fear discretion is advised. So I've been working with the Crestwood Police Department for about two years now. It's been good work, you know, nothing too uh, troubling or exhausting. Uh, as CPD officers, we uh, I like to aim to make sure the school grounds are kept safe from uh, uh, unfavorable acts by the student body. You know, they can happen sometimes. We got a 413 in progress. Officers, please respond. Uh, say again, your last dispatch over. We got a 413 in the California. Officers, please respond. Well, uh, roger that. Officer Chris responding. Uh, we got a 413 uh, butting in the lunch line going down in the cafeteria right about now. We're just going to pull up and take a look at that. Alright, let's go check it out. Officer Chris, responding to that 413, over. Yeah. Oh my god, oh my god. We got suspect inside. Sir, is this your rightful spot in line? What? Is this your rightful place in line? We got a runner. <laughs> oh, suspect apprehended. Get up, sir. You're under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a disciplinary hearing. You also have the right to one phone call to a parental unit or guardian of your choosing. You also have the right to one guidance appointment. If a guidance appointment cannot be made in time, one will be made for you. You're going away for a long time, punk. That's Super Mario you're playing over there? Yes. What world are you on? Very well. Carry on. Are you still playing games, sir? Yes, I am, sir. Thank you. Things are clear here. I'm with the force about a year and a half now, and I really feel I'm making my stand. You know, I enforce a lot of rules that other cops don't. A lot of cops don't take too kindly to gum chewing, but I think it's okay. But car idling, I'll have none of. Like, I just feel that hurting the environment as well as the school is just not acceptable. Hang on a second. I'll be there in a second. Dispatch. Here's we got a kid stepping out of line in the office. We're gonna go check it out. Come in. You should take a seat right over there. What's your name? Justin Cooper. Now, why do you think you're here, Justin? Oh, I came to see the principal. Let me tell you why you're here. <sighs> so, Justin, who are you gonna call? Good call. No! You call the Crestwood cops! <sighs> I just 
I just can't call home. I feel sick. Can you guys step out for a second? Who do you think you are? You attend school. All of your classes. You come to school sick. Don't come to school then. You're going to make other kids sick. Now get up. Attend your classes or don't come at all. Come with me. This kid thinks he's not to attend his classes. He's going to wait for a real long time. Part of our job as CPD officers includes undercover work. It can get a little dangerous, but we like to take every precaution to make sure our officers are good and safe. Uh, what we're doing right now is we're outfitting our uh, Deputy Cornelius with the latest in undercover technology uh, to make sure he gets the information we need without being spotted in the act. Uh, let's check in on him now. Uh, is uh, Cornelius ready? Over. Cornelius appears to be ready. Over. Sorry, I repeat your last over. Uh, he appears to be ready. Over. Roger that. So we set up a mock uh, cheat sheet transaction today. Yeah. Hoping you will catch yeah. illegal traffic. Yeah. 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 Uh, we're hoping she's got him in a book. She's got him in a book. We're hoping to make a transaction so we've got the evidence to take her down. Oh, there's a cheat sheet. Hydrate. All right, right. get ready. Moving. All units. Go. Moving. Go. Moving. Go. 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 Uh, suspect on the ground. Suspect apprehended. You're under arrest for tracking cheat sheets. We got her. This is, looks like she's going away for a hard time for this one. Part of the duties as a CPD officer at Crestwood Secondary School involves us patrolling school grounds as well as the parking lot. The car looks pretty suspicious. Let's go check it out. Do you realize you just broke a code of conduct? For what? I park here every day. Do not get hostile with me, sir. I will get physical. Hostile? All I said is I park here every day. Step out of the car, sir. Walk around, put your hands in the hood. Do you have any illegal drugs, substances, devices, anything like that? No. Turn your pockets out. Looks like we got some drug money here. Let's check this out. You stay right there. Oh, look at this. Got some gang attire as well. Some pretty low grade cheat sheets. Hey! Hey you! You're under arrest for trafficking cheat sheets as well as gang attire. This guy's going away for a really long time. Come on. Look at this, Shannon, she's a repeat offender. Now she's chewing gum in the library. It's analyst. What's that, Shannon? Uh, Don't answer gum. me. I know it's gum. Can you open your mouth? Gum, just as I suspected. You know what that qualifies as, Shannon? No. 507, that's chewing gum in the library. You know how to clean that up? No. Me, sometimes, but most of the janitors off the bottom of the tables. That is disgusting, Shannon. I'm going to have to take you under arrest. But why? Because it starts with gum and it ends with a mess. You're coming with me. Uh, Sick of handling these gum calls.